above all protect us over all times let's go uh, the lead left hand starting his offense with it as he's doing there shows how much he's progressed as a tactician he has reddened Delaware's nose from top to bottom with that punch it is I say the deal not how the speed and he cannot he doesn't block those right hands at all he has his right hand permanently stuck to the side of his face and, and Manny just punches us like a wild open invitation. Anything he has no defense. He's getting hit with virtually every shot that Pacquiao throws. There's no reason to continue with this. He's too fast. Are you okay You're with that? You agree? Yes. Right is on. Manny Pacquiao has beaten Oscar Delhoya. De La Hoya. I want you to obey my commands. Protect yourselves all times. Touch him up now. Good luck to both of you. Touches him with the right and the left there. Looking for him to land something big, and Diaz didn't manage to block the right hand. Big left over the top by Pacquiao, big left over the top by Diaz. Blood coming from the right eye of David Diaz. Already Pacquiao has brought blood from Diaz. Back to the crowd as he continues to fire resolutely in round six. And the Pacquiao storm. Once again, to his arms. How many more? Down he goes, and Dracula stops the fight. They should have never got to that. Welcome to the lightweight division. Gentlemen, we went over the rules in the dressing room. I want to caution you to keep the fight clean at all times, protect yourself at all times. This all started with a brilliant Pacquiao left hand, which looked for a moment as though it was going to knock Marquez down. This is a late round rally for Pacquiao. But this can change back and forth from this side here. Down goes Marquez on a straight left hand shot. Perfect shot by Pacquiao. Six, it may not have been a home run. But at the end of the day, it's the knockdown that creates the one point margin for Pacquiao. Pound for pound king Manny Pacquiao is looking to add another name to a Hall of Fame resume. It will be a historic fight. Everybody won't forget this fight. Now, gentlemen, we went over the rules in the dressing room. I want to caution to keep the fight clean at all times, protect yourself at all times, and when I say you must obey, good luck, touch up. Which again shows that he's no longer a one punch puncher. Well, follows the jab with a hook, comes back with another jab. There's the straight left hand, and he landed it right on Hatton's chin. And down goes Hatton after he swings and misses with a left hook. And that's a knockdown. Pacquiao's hands are so... Back. Pacquiao's hands are blindingly thick. His hands are so... Of course, Floyd Mayweather Sr. in the corner. The word is it's his last fight, but look at that right hook. Bang! Well, every time Ricky came forward, he was caught with a southpaw lead. It's as though they didn't know they were facing a southpaw. That and the slightest prepared for it. Heavy knockdowns and heavy punches when they get back up from the knockdowns. And as Freddie Roy said, Pacquiao used Ricky's own aggression to add to the power. I think Pacquiao may have spent the first two minutes of this round thinking knockout and allowed himself to get a little wild. Now he goes back to more precision. Yeah. Lands a hard body shot. But Ricky isn't moving his head too much still. No, his head is still. That is. Oh, oh my gosh, what a straight left hand. 
And will Hatton make it up from this? Can he beat the count? Is that it? And Kenny Bell says, no way. That is that. What an amazing knockout shot. That is the most spectacular one-punch shot of Manny Pacquiao's incredible career. Any fighter.